everybody, welcome back to the channel, Spicer Designs, I'm Kyle. As you can guess it, we're back in the garage. There's not a whole lot to do outside, obviously it's winter time, the ground's frozen, but I've got a lot of projects stacking up, so make sure you subscribe so that you can catch all those videos coming up in the spring and summer. I got this fancy little microphone here, because I noticed a lot of these videos, it's pretty echoey here in the garage. So I'm trying to make some improvements here to make uh, the videos a little bit better quality for you. All right, today's video, we're gonna be doing two things on the Coyote, uh, little upgrades. Uh, one of the things is we're gonna be changing out the headlights now. So we just changed out the work lights to LEDs, so now we're gonna do the headlights. Uh, the color temperature doesn't match right now. The headlights, the stock headlights are like a yellow, warm uh, color temperature, where the work lights, the new LEDs, are a brighter white color temperature. So I picked up some uh, LED headlights for the tractor. Um, I'll leave an Amazon link below for these uh, these headlights. I really wouldn't recommend these. They are they are brighter and they do match the work lights, but they're they're just kind of like cheap lights. Maybe do some more research and, and maybe figure out a better brand. But they did a good good review. So, all right. Another thing we're going to be doing today is we're going to be making an adjustment to the bucket level indicator. This was suggested by one of the subscribers named John. So thanks, John. Uh, I think it's a great idea. So. We're gonna uh, work on that and then we're gonna kind of test it out and see how much better it is. All right, so with this bucket level indicator, the suggestion from John was to cut the, the steel tubing part, cut it at an angle. That way as the rod comes up, you can start to see the rod coming up before it gets to the top of it, which is a great idea. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, cut that now. I'm gonna, I got a fire blanket here. I'm gonna throw that fire blanket on, and then I got my uh, cordless DeWalt cutting wheel here, so um, that's what I'm gonna use to cut it, and uh, we'll get this thing cut and try it out. cut. Let's take a close look at it. See I cut it at kind of a long angle so that way you can see that rod coming through as soon as possible. And then I only cut like halfway through. That way you can still have somewhat of a flat part there where you can see where it is actually at your level point. So great idea. Thanks John. Let's give this thing a try. So I'm all the way dumped right now. Coming back up level. Oh yeah, that is nice. I can see it as it as it's getting close to level. And I can stop it right where I want it. Before I would go past and then come back down. And uh, it kind of gets annoying after a while. So this is this is going to be great. Good idea. All right. So another thing I want to talk about is Hi. what I'm recording right now. No one wants to hear you ramble on. I was falling asleep over there. Let's do the job already. Is it that bad? It is. <laughs> Sorry. You're right, you're right. Well, since I'm right, why don't you uh, go give me a beer? I guess I could do that once. Beer boy. Man, he sure does talk a lot. I see her rolling up over black Cadillac High heel boots and a sexy body full of tats Baby's bad, oh baby's hella bad After her there ain't no coming back Wanna take a run at that I think she's feeling me Turn it up a few degrees My Here's your beer Thank you Can you open it for me? Yeah. Oh, thanks Thank you Thank you Thank you Thank you now that's good beer. No, it's not. Keep going! 
Don't forget about the uh, giveaway we're doing. So when we hit a thousand subscribers, we're going to uh, have a drawing and you'll win a custom steel sign, uh, roughly two foot by two foot. So make sure that you subscribe so that way you can be entered into the drawing. So, okay, so let's take a look at these new LEDs. Um, these are Oxalam. It's just some like Chinese brand, but they had a ton of good reviews on them. So I thought I'd try them out. I forgot how much they were. They might've been like 35 bucks or something. I got one of the old ones and one of the new ones. I could just kind of show you comparison here. You could see the LED one just has a little LED on each side. And then uh, the old halogen lamps. So the housing is the same style. The pin setup is the same on them. And they do note on the LEDs that these are polarity sensitive. So if they don't work the first time, you might just have to flip those wires, but uh, just keep that yellow wire on the bottom and you should be okay. Kidney? Don't mind if I do. All right, so we're underneath the hood here. Behind the uh, headlights, there's a little cap. You're just gonna go ahead and unscrew that and pull it off. It's just like a quarter turn. And then you can see we've got a, it's a blue or a black wire and a yellow. So the yellow goes on bottom. And uh, so you're gonna go ahead and pull those little quick connects off there. And then there's a little clip. You're just gonna push that clip out and pull the uh, old headlight out and put the new one in and reverse the reverse those steps it's pretty easy all right now that he's new headlights in let's take a look at before and afters hey i got something something to say i'm just so sick of hearing everyone complain i know it's tough and i know there's pain but hitting bottom is the only way to change so I'll keep hustling, you keep struggling, bitch I'm humbling, keep mumbling, I'll keep doubling, you keep bluffing, you've got nothing, I'll keep hustling. helps you out gives you some ideas with your tractor we got some good videos coming up so make sure you hit the like and subscribe thanks for watching see you in the next one it's really tough more often you like yeah we'll those things up next time <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that wraps up for today's video. <laughs> Battery lights flash. This is what we got. This is the kind of shit that happened. I have the new headlights in. Why are you looking at me? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do the same thing, Dan. Do something different.